All right, boys and girls, we're back with more Dragon Age 2. Last time we left off, uh, we found our mom to be a Frankenstein uh, experiment gone wrong. Uh, so now Bethany is going to be told by our uncle, Gamlin, and we have a few, few companion quests where we want to check up on us. So uh, let's go see him. See how our dog's doing. What the hell? Where did you get that? Should we take this outside and see if it floats? Thing over here. Great. Okay. Right, let's see if they have. Mistress Amal was a fine woman. Reminded me of my own mother. If there's anything I can do. All the cleaning's been done, and your equipment has been done. Okay. Let's go to the uh, hangman. Ugh, still some dead ass up in here. And we're gonna clean that. Oh, what the fuck? Anders, I won't be you. And then Hawk tore the door clean off its hinges, walked into the room, and. <clears throat> I guess we'll finish this later. Have you got a minute, Varric? Of course, Hawk. Actually, I've been meaning to talk to you. I hear you and the Ravani have something going. So, what's going on, Hawk? Isn't that a problem? You wouldn't bring this up just to gossip. What's on your mind? Shows what you know. I would definitely bring this up just to gossip. I didn't, but I would. Listen, as your friend, I feel like I'd be doing you a disservice if I didn't say something. Isabella is a great girl, but I think you're likely to get hurt. By which I mean stabbed and left for dead. Appreciate your concern. I know you mean well, Varric. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. I certainly hope so. Why is this place called the Hanged Man? Every time someone asks a stupid question, we string them up from the rafters. Okay, now we gotta talk to Abilene. Who is in? Oh. My eyes are just god damn. Fuck. Okay. And then we can go right to the back count. How much longer do I have to wait? Fine day, Sarah. It's different here as captain. Feels like family. Shut up, bitch. Hawk. I don't care what else is going on. We haven't spoken about Leandra. How are you? <laughs> yeah, blame it. It's your fault. Keep your sympathy for the next person you let die. What was that for? Your job is protecting the city. If you were any good, my mother would be alive. Yeah. Let's see. Well? Well what? You admit so it? you agree that you should have stopped this? Would have? Certainly. Could have? Some people are broken. I don't have an answer that can satisfy you. The guards never do. Cast your blame if you want, but this isn't about me. I'm sorry for your loss. Bitch. <laughs> I always gotta clean up your damn mess. Can't do one thing. Talk to the bike out. 
It is apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. They must also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Please, Sarah Hawk, convince Seamus to come home. They accept him? The says nothing good about Kirkwall, yet he accepts conversions. I cannot understand him. Maker knows I've tried, but he landed with, what, a few hundred men? Add up the deaths and defections, and the Arishok must need to bolster his ranks. I'm sure my son is quite the symbolic prize. Does anyone Did else anyone know? Else see him leaving for the compound? He made no secret of it. I'm sure he intended it as another of his statements about closer relations. Your example inspired him. I might agree, but now is not the time. These matters are... delicate. He's politically dangerous, you mean? The office must remain strong, Sir Ahawk. Did Oops. anyone else see him? Uh, that was a misclick. The office must remain strong. It's not his choice. He is of age. The decision seems rightly his. I want to let him find his way, but in my position, he's taken a great deal of inspiration from you. I want to allow his idealism, but not blindly. At best, my opponents will claim that my office is now in Kanari hands. At worst, I lose my son. This will get ugly. You know this will only end in trouble. Fitting. That's where it started. My son is not foolish. He will listen to reason, and you are in the best position to offer that opportunity. Please, do what you can. Okay. Wait, what the fuck? How do I get here? The fuck? This is something has ever happened before. Or like in the middle of a uh, traveling. I've actually got ambushed. Uh, Dragon Age Origins. Viscount or Seamus himself not wanting to be rescued. Seamus isn't the type. Let's go. Okay. What the hell was that? Someone explain. Oh, Isabel's not gonna like to go in here. Alright. The Arashok wasn't planning on keeping the Viscount's son. Probably do that. Sarah Hawk. I'm here about the Viscount's son. Are you? In four years, I have made no threat, and fanatics have lined up to hate us simply because we exist. But despite lies and fear, Ba's still beg me to let them come to the Kune. They hunger for purpose. The son has made a choice. You will not deny him that. Exactly what we need, isn't it? Converting the Viscount's son? His opposition will have a field day. And? 
The enemy of your enemy should be your friend? I don't fear the whole of them together. And it is not my role to reject the free choice of Vidathari. The son responded to his own demand of the Kuhn. He is neither my slave nor my prisoner. He is not even here. He went to his father. Ask the Viscount why he would send you and the letter both. Can you clarify? That seems strange. They are meeting at the Chantry. A last pointless appeal, I assume. The Viscount would involve the Chantry? No, but we know who would. Mother Patrice. A suspect in many things. If she has threatened someone under my command again, there is only one response. I agree, she's dead. I've had about enough of Patrice, several times over. A threat against Vidathari can have only one answer. I will suffer only one outcome. I will be watching, Hawk. The demand of the Kuhn is clear. Trees, you motherfucker. Trying to start some wars against the Kunari, you little slut. Won't let it happen. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. What are you doing, Seamus? What? Sarah Hawk, look at what you have done. To pounce upon the Viscount's son, a repentant convert in the Chantry itself. A crime with no excuse. Your Kunari masters will finally answer. I kill Shanks. You've been a headache, but to outright kill someone, that's new for you. He deliberately denied the Maker. How many would follow if he went unpunished? To blink. And yet, even this sympathizer will inspire vengeance when his brutal murder is exposed. You won't get the Kunari ousted. You'll get a slaughter on both sides. To die untested would be the real crime. People need the opportunity to defend faith, starting with you. I kill you, bitch. Earn your reward in this life and next. These heretics must die. I'm gonna get some. Yatch. You're gonna request this. Gonna request this. Yeah? Am I regretting it yet? Tell me I'm regretting it. Keep telling me I'm regretting it. They defile with every step. There is death in every corner, young mother. It is as you predicted, all too well. She already has death. See you, Patrice. Quick, lie harder. Don't you spout your kunari filth? This is a hand of the divine. I have ears, Mother Patrice. The Maker would have me use them. Sarah Hawk, is it? Viscount Dumas' son is dead. Killed here in your name. 
I'm sure my name won't like that. Patrice? Seamus Dumas was a Canari convert. He came here to repent and was murdered. Patrice arranged it and more. Love or hate the Canari, a blind nug could see she took this too far. No price is too much when we speak of eternity. Eternity is long enough that we need not rush to meet it. They deny the Maker. And you diminish him, even as you claim his side. Andraste did not volunteer for the flame. Sir Ahawk, you stand with the Captain of the Guard? The young mother has erred in her judgment. A court will decide her fate. The Chantry respects the law, and so must she. Grand Cleric? Hey! Stupid Grand bitch. Cleric? Ah, what are you gonna do it now? What? Damn! Cold blooded. We protect those of the Cune. We do not abandon our own. That's for shame, Miss Bitch. Please, send for Viscount Dumas. She pretty calm about that. It's a G move. My son. Murdered in the heart of the Chantry by those who held a sacred trust. What hope for this city? When we fail our own so completely. City needs you strong. This is not over, Excellency. The city needs a leader. It does. And I am no longer that person. Some loud thunder. I don't know if you can hear that. Hopefully not. Please. Hawk, leave me. Catch a thief. This won't exactly ease tensions. The Viscount's son and Canari aggression, even if justified. About that. Uh, Hawk, there's something I need to tell you. At your house. Very, very soon. There's always something to look forward to. That you stole something from the Canari. I already remember. That's why you never want to go inside. This is important. Don't interrupt with your selfish prattle. Get off your high horse. I have problems too. <laughs> what drink should I order and who's the father? Oh, you little... What is it now, you two? Hawk. The Arashok is sheltering two fugitives who have converted to the Cune. He must be convinced to release them. He's already feared because of Patrice. If people start to think he can ignore the law, I need your help so this doesn't get out of hand. I'm going to die. There. Got your attention. Real problem. One at a time. Hold on. What's this about? Remember the relic? The one Castillon is going to kill me over? A man called Wall-Eyed Sam has it. If you help me get it, Castillon won't kill me. Please. I'm trying to keep the entire city from rioting against the Canari. Well, maybe it's connected. What? I'm just saying maybe it will help. It's important to someone, right? Now you start being responsible? Shit. 
Where are the fugitives? Isn't it odd that someone would run to the Canari? They're elves accused of murder. Maybe they feel they've nothing to lose by fleeing the alienage. And if their conversion is genuine? I don't know. But how many more will try if I allow this? Justice must be respected. What will happen? You're expecting trouble. After what happened to the Viscount's son? Yes. I'm hoping the Canari aren't looking for a fight. I'm hoping they'll be reasonable. But we'll see. Might come to me, I believe. This seems like an issue for you and your guards. Quite a few of them. Sending a full patrol would just increase tension. But you're right. I am the captain. It's my responsibility. But I suspect the Viscount was hoping I would bring this to you. Then he should have come himself. Perhaps. But it's understandable that he's not at his best. I'd like to help him if I can. And you just now heard Why this? Why has this come up so suddenly, Isabella? Sam's been talking to black market dealers all over Lowtown. It didn't take me long to get wind of it. What frustrates me is that he's held onto the relic so long. Who are Sam's buyers? Who was involved in this exchange? Tivinter mages. I doubt they'll look kindly on us interrupting. Bring a sword, or twelve. Who's wall-eyed Sam? Tell me about Sam. Sam used to run with Martin. Remember him? Martin says Sam's a bit of a magpie, picking up things that don't belong to him. Not a trustworthy sort. When Martin gave up raiding, Sam became a drifter. Isabella, this is your relic? You're sure this is the relic you're after? I've had my ear to the ground for a while. There was a description of the book. It's the right one. Book? I thought you didn't know what the relic was. Well, I... I, I know it's a book, but that's all I know. It's written in a foreign tongue. Honestly, what does it matter? It'll save me from Castillon, so I need it. We'll help Isabella the first. The relic issue has to be resolved before we take on the Kunari. You trust her this much? Probably not. I wouldn't. They won't wait at the compound forever, Hawk. I really do hope this helps, because if it doesn't... You think I like having this thing on my mind? Come on. The exchange is happening tonight in a low town foundry. Are you sure about this? The champion was asked to go to the Canari. I suppose you think he planned the entire thing. Considering what it led to. Come on, Seeker. I'm not going to sell Hawk short, but nobody could have foreseen the way that that would go down. Or do you still think I'm lying to protect my friend? There are elements of your story that make sense. And you couldn't have known about them otherwise. Well, that's a relief. But that doesn't mean you're telling me everything. I want this story to be told. You're not the first to get it all wrong. I think I owe Hawk that much. Okay, to low town we go. Stream just crash. How was that? Uh, hold on. Now oh, check now. Still says it's going. Just gotta make sure. Looks like it's still going. Yep, okay. We're still good. We're still good, boys and girls. No need to worry. To the foundry, he said. Man. 
Sometimes you want to go where everybody knows your name. Oh, got some canary over here. What y'all doing? Oh, it's I don't dead. have your stupid relic. What the fuck? Stands up. Fuck. What's this like stand from Dragon Age Rock? Or Dragon Age Origins? Was. He's kind of a bitch. What are the Kunari doing here? Uh, yes. About that. The relic belongs to the Kunari, and there's a small chance they want it back. I need to know the truth. Tell me what you know. You can trust me. I've always known what the relic is. I just didn't want to worry you. The relic is a Kunari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Keslin, Kuzland, whatever his name is. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. And they can't leave without it. All of this could have been avoided. You stole the relic. You steal the relic from the Kunari. The Arishok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had plans to return it to the Canari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arishok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. But you stole the relic. How did you steal the... The Arishok... Uh, uh, Getting the relic was uh, easy. You, what about the shipwreck? I thought you and the Canari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Canari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. Return it into the Canari Maybe go. Maybe giving it back would solve Aveline's problem. It couldn't hurt. Says you. I know it will save my skin. Ah, oh, Why can't this be as easy as you? Values why a relic. Why anyone besides the Canari want this relic? The Tevinta Imperium have been at war with the Canari for centuries. If the Tevinters get the relic, it will strike a blow to Canari morale. That's probably what the mages want. Hold this over a book? Like the Canari take their reading very seriously. Is there anything the Canari don't take seriously? Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. There's more at stake, but... Well, the Arashok waited this long. Oh, I don't know. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. Uh, damn it, we'll get the relic brief. Your life depends on it. Really? I... I wasn't expecting that. It's nice to have someone on my side for once. Don't make us regret it. Come on, we've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I... Uh... I have it! The Tome of Coastland will not fall into Deventer hands! Blood and spite! A toss, Canari! He's getting away! Isabella! Do with the mages first. Oh, okay, this is a different stem then. 